Sophie Turner suing her soon-to-be ex, Joe Jonas, saying he's refusing to hand over their kids' passports, which is stopping Turner from taking them back to England. Documents also say the couple's kids, who are both really young and have dual citizenship, have been, I'm quoting here, wrongfully retained in New York City and that Jonas refused to let them go with their mom. A representative for Jonas tells NBC News he hopes Turner will reconsider what he calls her harsh legal position and move forward in a more constructive and private manner. I want to bring in our NBC News legal analyst, Angela Senadella, who's joining us now. There is a connection to The Hague here, right, mm -hmm. through something called the child abduction clause. That's what is raising so many of these thorny legal questions. Explain that. So the Hague Convention is invoked in order to allow a court order from one country to apply to another country. So it's virtually impossible to get one law in one country applied abroad. And so that's what's happening here. But I'm going to say that this is actually much bigger than just questioning where the children are going to reside. I think that the reason why Sophie Turner is doing this is because she wants to move the entire divorce proceedings, all of the custody hearings, all of the court hearings, until these children turn 18, to England, because that's what happens if she wins this lawsuit. The habitual residence changes from the U.S. to England, and that means Joe Jonas has to hire all new lawyers. He's got to go to the U.K. every time he wants to ask the judge for something. I mean, mm. this is chaotic. The filing says that Turner and Jonas met just last week to talk about the separation, that they had an agreement for the kids to go, at, go back to England with Turner, with a rep for Jonas saying the meeting was cordial, if you will. And now here we are, right, days later with this. These documents also revealing, I believe, that Turner uh, found out through the divorce filing through the media, essentially. Um, this tactic, right, this lawsuit, does it escalate this custody fight? Yes, it absolutely does. And that's why I said earlier, I think it's really about venue, it's strategy, it's a chess game. It's not even just about the custody. Because you know what, Hallie? I think no matter what happens, they're going to end up sharing custody. These children are dual citizens. Mm. They have all the resources to have them across the, across the world. So I think it's not even about where the children are going to be raised. It's about getting the strategy on and getting the home court advantage. Angela Senadella. Thanks for watching. Stay updated about breaking news and top stories on the NBC News app or follow us on social media.